Uh, Thea and Olivia, congratulations on the film. I, I really love this one. So I have a lot to ask you guys. Great. Thank Great. you. Thea, let's start with you. So it's in a, lo a lot of ways, a small movie with that talks about a lot of big ideas. Uh, what is What did you want to say about uh, the role of women and maybe how women communicate with the film? Um, do you know, the funny thing is when you phrase it like that, that's exactly how I see it. I, for me, it's all about the detail. It's all about understanding who the characters are and what their journey is and what it is. How do you make a moment feel real between two people? Um, if you get those details right, then the bigger stories come out naturally. What I love about this story and the, and the script and the way it was put together by Johnny Sweet in the first place, he managed to take a crazy, re true story. And somehow he's created a world that is very much based in the in the what really happened um, with the real people. But he, uh, for me, what I loved is the subtlety with which he brought in some really big themes, as you say, that I think if he in in not such tender hands could have been quite cack handed and a bit um make of the film very heavy and and sort of deeply philosophical and and quite hard to watch but actually what we've created i hope is something that has a lightness and a freshness but if you you know and you just can have a laugh it's it's just entertainment it's 96 minutes that you that it's quite easy to watch i think and if you then come out of it and on top of that you want to talk about female emancipation, women in the workplace. You know, there's lots of how difficult a repressed home life can be for a woman who lives under a father like that, still at home. Um, or the freedom of somebody who's moved from Ireland with a young child, living with a man who is clearly not the father of her child and how she was dealt with 100 years ago compared to now. All of these things are there. And, and comparing also language literally the use of language as well as trolling what we yeah. how we do it these days compared to a poison pen letter you know 100 years ago so there's so much in there i i think for people to take away whatever it is that that yeah. resonates most of all with them yeah olivia i i just loved your character and um you gave such humanity to her. She, you know, she kind of delights in becoming this small town celebrity. So talk a little bit about how you bring humanity to these people who may be sort of unsympathetic uh, at, at first blush. Um, well, I don't know. I think I, I, knew, I knew from reading it that she had her reasons and I felt enormous empathy towards her and what she was having to live with. Um, and so, her sort of, I mean, it's awful to be unkind anonymously about anybody, awful. But I found her in particular, it was quite funny the way she did it. You know, she had really rubbish swears and it, she just put all of the bad things she could think of. Oh, this is a bit of a spoiler, isn't it? Sorry. Uh, <laughs> but um, when you find out what her life is like behind closed doors and the, you know, the fear she lives with uh, moment to moment at home, under the thumb of a very controlling father. And she has no agency over her own life, no no means to escape. Um, it it does become clear. You understand she's being oppressed and you hold put a woman in a box, it's gonna come back to bite you in the ass. And <laughs> uh so I I I didn't find her unlikable actually. I I find anybody who can be unkind to another human being awful. But I could see why she was doing it. You know, that thing, hurt people, hurt people. Um, you can see why. I would like to sort of, uh, I'd like to give the people who say cruel things to, to strangers a cuddle and say, don't do it. You won't feel better for it. Or you might momentarily, but you're really hurting others. And, you know, the fallout from, from seeing something publicly about you, which is so unkind, it can have really, really terrible, terrible consequences. And uh, that's not good. But Edith, I did find empathetic. Uh, I felt empathy towards her. Well, it, it's a wonderful film, you know, both on, on a kind of light, funny level, but also on kind of a, a level that made you think. 
Uh, so Olivia and Thea, thank you so much for sharing your thoughts on it. Oh, thank, thank you. you very much. Thank you so much. Lovely talking to you. Thanks for watching the You Interview channel. With over 3,000 original celebrity videos, we have one of the largest collections of celebrity interviews anywhere. So remember to like and comment on our videos and subscribe to the channel. If you want to get more involved, you can become a member of the channel. Membership has its perks. You can see exclusive celebrity videos and get the opportunity to ask our celebrity guests questions. We can't wait to hear from you.